Number 10 asks, which side of the equilibrium is favored and why? So we have two chair conformations for this compound. They're going to be of differing energies, and that is going to have to do with the substituents being either equatorial or axial. So here we have a methyl that is axial. We have a hydroxyl that is equatorial, and we have a methyl that is equatorial. Then over on this side, remember, when we do the chair flip, axial substituents become equatorial and equatorial substituents become axial. This methyl that was axial becomes equatorial. This hydroxyl that was equatorial becomes axial. This methyl that was equatorial becomes axial. Axial is the less stable position. For example, over here, we have these implied hydrogens, and there are diaxial interactions happening between the methyl and those hydrogens that are destabilizing. It's an example of steric hindrance. We want to minimize the axial substituents. And so comparing this here, each of these chairs has one axial methyl and one equatorial methyl group. We have an axial methyl there, an axial methyl there, and we have an equatorial methyl there and an equatorial methyl there. It's as though those cancel out. Each chair has one axial methyl and one equatorial methyl. So the difference is that we have an equatorial hydroxyl there and an axial hydroxyl there. So that is going to be the substituent that determines this for us. It is going to be the one with the equatorial hydroxyl that is more favorable. And you can look at it either way, right? We've got two equatorial substituents in one axial. That's better than two axial and one equatorial because those methyls cancel out. There are times where we will have to compare substituents. You want to weigh two methyls versus one tert butyl or something like that. But here we don't have to think about that. We've got methyls that cancel each other out. So it is going to be the hydroxyl being equatorial. We're favoring the chair on the left because there are more substituents that are in an equatorial configuration. More substituents being equatorial, less steric hindrance, more favorable, more stable.